Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of the Minecraft Progression Series. This time around, we will not be doing too much, oops, as this is a sort of small update that didn't add a lot to the game, but added a decent amount to it. In this case, 1.4 beta 1.4 underscore zero one added cookies and wolves. It also changed the spawning of sheep and spiders. In essence, spiders no longer have a sound when they walk around, and sheep can now appear with brown wool. Previously, it was impossible to obtain brown wool without the use of commands. So, for this let's play here, well, introducing Satoko and Rika from Higurashi. Now, it sounds kind of messed up, but then you realize that this image exists, and this is actually what she says in Neko Han. so I'm not going to say it's bad. I'm saying this is totally fair game. I'll even change their colors when we get to it. I'll make a Satoko yellow and Rika blue. I might as well show off the the new brown wool. And the spawn is rare. Also, pink sheep can now spawn, but I'm not getting very lucky with it. And even that we already have our pink and whatever the hell this color is, magenta, probably. And I'm really liking this house. This house doesn't look very great from this perspective, but from the main base, it looks great. It really does. At the very least, I think it looks great. I also added torches to this side of the pillar as well, so that it doesn't look as dark and depressing. Because before that, it did look depressing. What else did I do in this update? Not too much, really. Like I said, this update didn't really add too much, and I would like to show off cookies. However, cocoa beans still don't spawn in the game yet. You have to get them in a chest from a mine shaft, and those are completely random to find. Because of that, it's not actually worth trying to get them, so I'm not going to bother with it. At the least, not for the time being. In addition, I decided to save that for when we get to pre-release 1.9 because by that point the stronghold will be in the game. Cool, no? This happened a while ago, but I figured I might as well show this off because I don't think I've ever actually accurately explained it, but a lot of my trees have the incorrect leaves on them. You can see that there's oak, birch, and spruce leaves on these oak trees. The reason for that is because when the game was updated from alpha to the alpha wherein the color of the leaves changed, the game bugged out and just gave them random leaves. In addition, the speed at which wheat grows has been sped up. We still do not have the recipe for a pumpkin seed. As for the note block project, I gotta tell you that has, this has been an endeavor. An endeavor and a half. The kind that I never thought I would undertake, but I figured, I might, actually, is it in the game yet? I'm not too sure. Nope, not in the game yet. Oh, did they fix the bug with how it appeared? Nope. They did not. That will be fixed later, I assume. Damn it. Jump, jump, we're out. I don't know why I decided to make it parkour to get out of the base, but it's fun. At least, I like to think it's fun to some extent. Otherwise, it would be boring to not do anything. You know, I said that I would turn down the sound, but I didn't realize it'd be that quiet. I just didn't want the animals to get in the way of the commentary. I also like hearing the grass sound walking effect and the effect of walking on cobblestone. To me, I think it's nice. So, a bit different from how basic redstone works. Redstone didn't travel through blocks back in the day. Look. Oh, it did, but it's not making this one sound. Why? Why aren't these ones sounding? 
Is it because they're not being held long enough? No, that can't be it. Or maybe I just don't have my sound high enough. Options. Oh shoot. What the hell? Why'd it break? I don't know. Okay. Okay. So this should work now. I do not get it. Hmm. If anyone, and why is there a limit to how far it goes? Because it only goes up to here. Look. It only goes up to here. Well, that makes sense because all the repeaters. But I don't think the game can recognize that these are trying to be lit up with redstone because it's too fast of a system. I get that repeaters were introduced just recently into the game, by this point in the update history, but music. But at this point, it should be up and running, more operational than how it is running currently. And I'm not too sure as to what is causing it to not work. I will try to figure that out sometime on my own, but for now, these are the difficulties that we have to live with if I want to make this work. Nope. I don't get it. Really don't. Maybe it's just a bug and it'll fix itself, so for the time being, this little project will be put on hold. And the idea is it's going to play, if you guys recognize this pattern, it's going to play the Happy Sugar Life intro, Wine Room Sugar Life. At least that's the plan. I want it to play a song so that I can brag to my friends. That's it. I don't actually need to make it a song. It's just for fun. What else is going on? Thinking. Because of course we can keep walking and that'll be fine. And as you can see, we still find the white sheep at the most common. What, are the, what else changed? Right, we got beds. Well, we got those in the last update. But what changed with beds recently is this. They now set your spawn point. At least they properly now set your spawn point. Supposedly they did back in beta 1.3, but I never saw evidence of that. Other than that, this update's pretty much over. I, I can't think of anything else other than getting cookies that could be any content for this update. The problem is that once more, getting cocoa beans to get cookies is completely random. And not something you can plan. What the hell? Perfect. As for why a zombie doesn't spawn and just kill me, it's because A, we have slabs here, and B, we have torches. With those two stipulations in Matt, the zombies won't spawn and they won't kill me. It's too bright for them to kill me. Although I will admit, this looks really cool. The brown wool kind of weakens it, but I have to show it off. I mean, it was added in this update as something obtainable in survival. I think that's it. So, you know what? Before I sign off, I want to see what was added in beta 1.5. So, Minecraft beta 1.5 patch notes. Let's see what was added. Okay. The charge creeper was added, burning pig has now dropped cooked pork chops, and we can now get birch. Birch, cool. So 1.5 lets us add the rails, the cobweb, which is not currently obtainable, the leaves I can drop from saplings, good. The grass block now has a different texture, beds cannot be used during thunderstorms, and ladders can no longer be climbed to their empty blocks, so 1.5 changes a lot of the game. If that is the case, I will leave that for the next video. I will make it to the tree farm so that I have enough ladders to make things work.
So that's it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Good. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Apparently, I can't count. But it'll be okay. Because we can now get different sapling kinds types. And being able to get different sapling types means we can get the other trees and we can make more farms in this direction. At least that's the goal. What I'm going to do with those farms, I don't know. I also want to thank you all for 15 subscribers, ladies and gentlemen. You guys do a lot. I really do. I want to thank you for that, though. I'm not being facetious and being genuine. Although, telling when I'm genuine is rather difficult nowadays, according to some people. I decided to watch My Hero Academia with Mach 854. And he's like, I regret showing you this because you have all the wrong opinions. I'm like, I'm allowed to have different opinions from you. At least I think I'm allowed to have different opinions from somebody. I don't know if that's changed, but because I really don't know, honestly. The internet's so weird these days. Like I said, I took a really long break from the internet. And now that I'm back, it's a different, it's a different, you know, landscape. It's, it's as if the world has gone awry. As if people have just lost their minds nowadays, and I don't get it. Maybe someone could enlighten me. But the, it's as if people are just so sensitive nowadays. And I'm not targeting anyone in particular, it's just I've noticed it from people. So if anyone could like to tell me, would like to tell me what's been going on, I'd be very happy to know. Okay, so I still need a few more wood. I, I, I'm being serious though. I, I legitimately don't know what's going on. And then why are people so sensitive now? Because that's the part that bothers me. Oh, what else is added in the next update? Achievements are adding in the next update. And these achievements are actually doable. Just have to make another cake. Wonderful. The lie. Funny. The big lie. Delicious fish. No, you mean to tell me that I actually have to do on a rail again? So we have to do rail shaft Magnus again? Great. Well, at least I have an excuse to call something rail shaft Madness again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay. All right. I'm just gonna close with the ritual. <coughs> so I, I I honestly don't know. Like, are we still allowed to have different opinions from people on the internet? I'm 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 being genuine here. I I, li I literally do not know anymore. Because I, I hear from people now, it's like, oh, you gotta be careful on the internet. You can't talk like you used to. I'm like. I'm aware of that much. I even even I agree that I spoke like a like a jackass when I was younger. So if that is the case, I would like to know if you guys could give me a list or something, like give me a Google Doc or something, share it with me in the comments. Just say anyone who has a link in the scene and tell me what are things I can and can't say, and I'd be very happy to hear it. I know that sounds kind of selfish of me, but at the same time, I don't want to end up getting kicked off the platform. I really don't. This is really nice. It's going to look amazing when it's finished. At least, I hope it does. Because that's the plan, right? We want things to look good, otherwise, there's no point. And like I said, I'm leaving this side for full release. We did this one for beta, this one for alpha, and then this side for pre-release. And then over there is full and then over there is full release. I can't wait for this to finish. Like I said, this is the multi this is the multi update project. So this, even though I said I started in 1.3, this will be going on for mul multiple updates. In fact, if it's finished by full release 1.6, I'll be impressed. I really will be. But it's going to be great when we finish it. At least I think so. 
1.4 is over though. Like after this, Minecraft gets achievements. Not advancements, but achievements. And these add a whole new layer of challenge. Whether or not I'm going to do the achievements is another story. But we're still debating it. <coughs> it would give me an excuse to use a saddle though. And I love using saddles when I have an excuse. And I have multiple too, so if I waste one, it's not too big of a deal. So you can ask me. My only issue with saddles is that they're completely random. The challenge is random. Seven, one, two, three, four, five, seven. Still, so he was he was telling me. Like I can't believe you. You have all the wrong opinions about things. Like, are, are you serious? I don't remember there ever being a time where someone was literally telling me like I have the wrong opinion. Like maybe I could have an opinion you disagree with, and I'd be fine with that. But to be told my opinion is wrong was shocking to say the least. I, I don't actually know what to say to that. I really don't. Why do I keep going back there thinking there's a crafting bench? A crafting bench? A workbench or crafting table? Stick to one, Miguel. Stick to one. I don't even care if you use the old one. I mean, I like workbench. It sounds more natural. Crafting table sounds like a video game term. Workbench sounds realistic. Okay. I don't even know why I'm making sticks there. I guess it's because I want to. This means is I'm. I guess I update in the next one. Because for the time being, we're done with this. 1.4 didn't add too much, except for adding Satoko and Rika. I was originally going to name the two dogs Ideal and Warheight as a reference to a book I wrote back when I was a minor. But, considering what that would do, it would incentivize people to go look at the book and then be like, Oh, you're cancelled. You said some naughty words. I mean, look, I was a minor. I, I know I said some really bad words. I'm not going to remove the book. I mean, I still have it set to 18 plus to this day. As in, you can't buy it on Amazon without setting it to 18 plus. So, without having the account that says 18 plus. So, I know for a fact that minors won't buy it, but nowadays, even adults get offended by things. It's weird. It really is. Now, still, once again, I know for a fact that I said some pretty messed up things back in the day. Do I defend them? I won't defend that I said them, but I also won't badmouth anything I said. So, for the time being, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all enjoyed.